Hey, what's up, guys? It's Eli Fishman from TalkingBall.net and YouTube. Eli Fishman Sports, back with another interview. Today, I'm happy to be joined by New York Yankees prospect Tim Lynch. Tim, thank you so much for coming on today. No problem, Eli. Anytime. Thank you so much for coming on today. You out of out of high school, you didn't get drafted, but you had offers to go to the Reds and the Dodgers, uh, but you turned them down to go to Southern Mississippi. Was that hard? You had professional contracts. It was more after my third year of college. I had those offers. Um, you know, I played in a summer league up in New England and. The opportunity to, to go back to school and finish my degree was something that I take a lot of pride in and I, I worked hard at and I'm proud of that I completed it. Um, and obviously going back and playing ball with your great friends for one more year was an awesome opportunity and things worked out. I ended up getting drafted by the New York Yankees, which is a dream come true and I'm, I'm pretty happy with my decision for sure. Uh, you, uh, so you played four years at Southern Mississippi for the Golden Eagles. Can you talk to me about playing at Southern Miss? Oh, it was awesome. I mean, uh, I honestly couldn't have had a better experience. You know, there's a really big baseball fan base there. The facility is, is top notch, and the academics are great. You know, uh, I had, you know, the coaches were the same people that recruited me through the same people my all four years. And so, though, you know, they're real high character people. And whenever you get to deal with people like that, you're always going to have a great experience. So it was, it was awesome. After an All American senior season, you were drafted in the ninth round by the Yankees. How did it feel to hear your name called in the draft by, you know, the Yankees, one of the most prestigious organizations in all of sports? Yeah, I mean, you know, you you can maybe say Dallas Cowboys, or but the Yankees are, you know, they're the number one probably known franchise in, in the world, I'm one of the most known brands in the world up there with, you know, Coca-Cola and, and things of that nature. So it's to get drafted by a major league club is a surreal feeling, but for it to be the New York Yankees is just, you know, it, it honestly couldn't get any better than that. Last year, you split time in the Appalachian League with the Pulaski Yankees and in the Gulf Coast League with the Gulf Coast League Yankees. What were some of the biggest things you learned in your first year of professional baseball? Uh, just trying to not get too high, not get too low. You know, you try to just go out and create a routine, something that you do this similar every single day or the same thing every single day to get you ready to play. And, and that, getting ready to play every day. You know, in college, you play four times a week, sometimes five, but here you're playing every single day. So the biggest thing was... You know, sometimes you're going to have good games, sometimes you're going to have bad games, but you need to prepare the same way, and that was probably the biggest lesson I took out of my first professional season. Uh, you're in minor league baseball, 142 game season, and you're you know living the minor league life. You don't get the fancy jets. You gotta yeah for traveling. It's it's rough. You you know everybody calls it the minor league grind, grinding every day in and out. Has it been hard to stay consistent with your work, or is it easy to have success and stay consistent? Oh, I mean, here, you know, it's with the, you know, I don't know, I've never experienced any other organization, but here it seems like they have almost every advantage for you. You know, every, you got all the nutritional supplements you need. You know, they feed us great. Um, the facilities are obviously top notch. So that that aspect of it has been very nice. But as far as you know, the minor leagues, it's, you know, it's it's a, it's an awesome experience. You know, I think coll collegiate summer ball league sometimes gets you get you ready. I played in the Northwoods League a little bit, which compares a little bit to the minor leagues just with the travel system and staying in a lot of hotels and being on the road a lot but no I mean it it's it's definitely an awesome experience I grew up going to a lot of Florida State League games in Jupiter so you know it's uh, I like to think I had a good idea of what it was like and it wasn't too much of a surprise but there's there's a couple things here and there but you know it's it's been a great experience for sure. Uh, has the New York Yankees organization lived up to expectations? Oh absolutely I mean just come walking through the halls and you see the pictures, you know, the pictures, the retired numbers, the World Series championships. It's, you know, it's it's unbelievable to be a part of, you know, something like this. And, you know, it's my dream to get to the big leagues and contribute to a World Series team. It would be phenomenal. All right. Thank you so much for joining no